So I'm going to give you a quick view of the new 200 watts of solar I got on the roof. So these two panels are the new panels I have. And you can see right here, I'm just butting them right next to each other. There's no reason why you can't. You don't have to have them spaced apart. You can put them as close as you want because it's the sunlight that's going to be powering these things. I get them as close as I can to the edge. I'm going to bolt it to there, there. Now, when I do bolt these down to the spot, before I do, I'm going to lift this up. I'm going to put a little bit of that uh, uh, sealant underneath it. And I'll sit it down on the sealant. And then I'm going to bolt it to it. And then I'm going to put the self-leveling sealant on top of this. That way there's a little layer below. It's bolting down. And then a little bit of layer above it. That way there's no leaks possible for this. And then all these extra cables, I'm going to drill a little tiny hole here and just cable tie it straight to here. That way these cables can stay out of the way. And you got plenty of space in here. Just make sure you, you drill low. You know, don't drill high and, and ruin your panel. Drill low on it. And you can put these tie it right there. Tie it right off. So that's how I'm going to hook the power up. And like I said, I got 200 watts of power over there. I'm adding 200 watts over here. And, oh, one more thing. See that air conditioner on the roof, which I'm not going to be using anymore, thank God. See how far away I'm mounting these away from it? And you see that panel is shadowed right now. That means just one of those squares is shadowed. That panel will not run anymore. So that panel is not charging anything because of the shadowing. Now I know we're we're so early, you know, it's like uh, 9 a.m., you know, early-ish. But at 9 a.m., that panel is doing nothing. So that's why this new panel over here is 45 degrees away from, at a 45 degree angle away from that air conditioner. That way I can get as much power as I can out of this. But like I said, if one part but this panel is shadowed, the entire panel will not power. So you will lose 100 watts of charging power because of one little tiny shadow. So if you get a shadow on a corner, that panel is doing nothing. So make sure you get that panel as far away from any kind of uh, blocking debris or anything that's going to block it. Basically an air conditioner. Keep it away from the air conditioners. General rule is 45 degrees. That way you get a pretty good amount of sunlight during the whole day.